Round number 14, Ray Mancini fairly leapt off his stool, perhaps trying to show the comp champion that he is feeling better, stronger, more alert. We'll find out. This is round 14, three consecutive big rounds for Arguello, including the big right hand at the end of round 12. What a beautiful fight Mancini has put up thus far. You have to give him credit for that. No question about that. He's given everything as everybody expected he would, but he is still in some trouble here in round 14. Gilly, you got to believe that if the big one punch comes, it's more likely to come from the champion than from Mancini. So it's truly uphill now for Mancini. Well, Tim, we had mentioned that earlier. You could, you could be out pointing a guy like Aguayo, and once you go punch to punch with him, all of a sudden he hits you with that big one and turns everything around. And that's just what happened in the fight. Ray is still bouncing on his legs, Tim, but as you said, he has no snap in his punches anymore. He does look a little more alert, a little more bright-eyed this round than he did in round 13. Tim, he, he is so good. Toe, he took two more good punches from the champion, John. What a guy. He <laughs> just threw a good combination and backed the champion up temporarily. You know, Sean, he may not walk out of the ring with the championship of the world, but he's sure a champion as far as I'm concerned. Absolutely. He's won my heart in this fight. Well, I think at age 20, everybody expected uh, win or lose or draw that he'd be back for 20 or more on the lightweight ranks. We're not writing him off yet, of course. It's only round 14. Anything can happen. But it appears that the champion has turned the tide from about the midway point in this fight. He landed he's hurt again, to him. He's hurt he is hurt. this time. There he goes. Right hand sent him down, but it was two strong lefts, and that's it. Tony Tim, Perry says that's and enough. Right, rightly so, Tim. He yeah. was hurt badly. There's no sense letting it go on any further. He could no longer win the fight. Tony Perry stepping in to prevent any further damage. Two big left hooks and then a following right hand. And Alexis Arguello has successfully defended his crown. Here's another look at that knockdown by Arguello. He shot the left hook, then he came back with another right hand. And then I believe another left hook. There it was. Reach and from the first punch. from the first punch that Ray Mancini got got hit with, he was out. Well, here we go. Look at him drop that right hand underneath to set up the left hook. Now Ray doesn't know where he is at all, and just got hit with two more punches. He's a complete fighter. He he let uh, Mancini take control in the first rounds. Let Mancini get excited. Let Mancini uh, get hyper about winning the title. Let him get out in front. There's that right hand. Ugh. The winner, and still, the WBC lightweight champion, Alexei Arguello.